Police have released new information about what happened the day a Largo attorney disappeared. Detectives have yet to find Stephen Cozy. He was last seen at his law office on Tuesday. But the man arrested in connection to his presumed murder is expected to face a judge this afternoon. Fox 13's Kelly Tracy is live at the Pinellas County Courthouse where Tomas Kozowski will make his first appearance. And Kelly, police just released an affidavit in this case. What does it reveal? Yeah, we learned... A lot of new disturbing details we learned in that affidavit this morning, including that cameras outside the law firm that Stephen Causey worked at. Well, it says in that affidavit they picked up an unidentified white male walking into the law firm carrying a large box and a backpack, wearing gloves as well, just minutes before the victim. That's the same day that Causey was reported missing. Now, about two hours later, the affidavit says that person was seen carrying the box and backpack. He left the building in different clothes. Cameras show him struggling to put a large cart with a red bag or blanket, pushing that out of the building towards a truck. During the investigation, officers say there was a strong chemical odor coming from the men's bathroom of that law firm. The affidavit says forensics found a large amount of blood that had been cleaned up on the bathroom floor. Blood was smeared on the bathroom door, the stall, and the toilet. Police obtained a search warrant on Kozowski's home and Saturday stopped him in another car on his way back to Pinellas County. That affidavit says he left Left town the same day Causey went missing. The affidavit says in that car that they stopped him in, police found a ballistic vest with a lot of blood on it, a bag with masks, a taser, brass knuckles, duct tape, and sedatives with syringes. They also found that truck from the scene in Kozowski's garage with blood in that truck. Now, according to court documents, Kozowski's sued his old employer just a few years ago and in that lawsuit he says the woman assigned to do his insurance billing did not file claims and lied to his patients costing him tens of thousands of dollars and he says resulted in negative reviews online. Causey is listed as one of the attorneys for several of the defendants in that case and I do also want to note that affidavit also details that Causey missed a telephonic court hearing the morning that he was reported missing but the suspect was on that call, the affidavit says. Now, Causey's family describes him on social media as loving and brilliant and a great partner to his husband. But like we were saying, we still, police say, have not found his body. And Largo police are asking if you have any information to please contact them regarding this case. At 1.30 this afternoon, the suspect will make his first appearance and will be in that courtroom and share more details with you later. Back to you. All right, well, thoughts are with Causey's family. Kaylee Tracy reporting live for us. Thank you.